for reasons which I don't have the time to get into tonight, you're going to have a situation, I suspect, in states like Pennsylvania, uh, Michigan, uh, Wisconsin, other states, where they are going to be receiving huge amounts of mail-in ballots. And unlike states like Florida or Vermont, they're not being able, for bad reasons, to begin processing those ballots until, I don't know, election day, or maybe when the polls close. That means you're gonna have states dealing with perhaps millions of mail-in ballots. Here is my worry. What polls show and what studies have shown is that for whatever reason, Democrats are more likely to use mail-in ballots. Republicans are more likely to walk into polling booths on election day. It is likely that the first votes that will be counted will be those people who came in on election day, which will be Republican. And here is the fear, and I hope everybody hears that, but it could well be that at 10 o'clock on election night, Trump is winning in Michigan, he's winning in Pennsylvania, he's winning in Wisconsin, and he gets on the television, he says, thank you Americans for re-electing me, it's all over, have a good day. Frankly, we did win this election. We did win this election. So our goal now is to ensure the integrity for the good of this nation. This is a very big moment. But then the next day and the day following, all of those mail-in ballots start getting counted. And it turns out that Biden has won those states. At which point Trump says, see, I told you the whole thing was fraudulent. I told you those mail-in ballots were crooked. And I got, you know, we're not going to leave office. I knew they couldn't win. So they said, let's go to court. And did I predict this, Newt? Did I say this? I've been saying this from the day I heard they were going to send out tens of millions of ballots. I said exactly because either they were going to win or if they didn't win, they'll take us to court.